So I am here with Thorsten, president of Gebscam, and Thorsten, I really want to know more about the Sambic as a whole, the strategy here, and Gibbscam, what's coming, and then the partnership. You have a lot of different partnerships going on. Yeah, that's correct. Um, so, uh, yeah, Gibbscam is part of Sandvik Group. Yes. And we are uh, one BU of eight, nine uh, in this intelligent manufacturing area. And yeah, partnership is a core thing. Um, so that means we are doing partnership within the division, so between the BUs. Yeah. So we are cooperating with Vericut uh, and other brands, mm -hmm. and uh, so and yes, partnership is important because we are getting a lot of positive feedback and and say, hey, in which direction do you want to go? And we see or identify very clear artificial intelligence as one of the core topics, maybe as a big game changer on uh, different fields of activities, and that is the reason why we have. Um, we are using already two um, AI tools in our development department ourselves and we have a cooperation with up to parts in cloud and C to offer to our customers these um, yeah, big advantages using AI in production or in planning. Hey, I really love the commitment as a company to empowering the machine shops and the manufacturers out there. Everybody's talking about how hard it is to get people, the baby boomers are all leaving. So making it so these humans can focus on their areas of excellence. So when it comes to the focus for Gibbscam and all of the support that you are bringing, what's really driving that development? So I follow here two strategies for yep. Gibbscam. So first of all, let's say these new AI tools, they're working more for the, let's say, entry solutions, yeah. three axis milling stuff at the moment. This will develop for sure ahead and within the next one to two years. Yes. But I think, as you said before, we have this gap upcoming of missing staff, missing qualified staff. Yes. And I think the combination of a good CAM software, as Gibbscam is, combined with those AI tools, we can, let's say, not close the gap, but reduce the gap. And so this is one strategy, and the second one is for Gibbscam very clear to focus on advanced technologies, let's say five axes and everything above, like multitask machining and Swiss machining. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's important to understand AI. Everybody's talking about AI, but that's the, not the only focus. Some companies right now are just focusing on AI integration, but Gibbscam, you're doing a lot of other things to develop the software. Yes, of course, as I said. So we, we, we believe, or I believe, in this AI approach, and I'm super excited about it, and I think it's an unbelievable opportunity for, for the industry, for the people, for us as a company, and also to focus on these advanced technologies, because um, if you talk about value chain and all these things, mm -hmm. I think it's more in these complex parts. And so you need a high level of automation for yes. more simple parts, excellent, combine it with AI to achieve to be super efficient, economic, and then to go on the complex parts where we are really technically leading in the market. Yeah, and the complex parts is part of the work that we need to be bringing back. I mean, you and I are both in North America. I would like to see more work there. No offense oh, to the rest oh. of the world. <laughs> yeah, indeed. And, and we must be clear that our regions, not only Northern America, also yeah. Central Europe, we have yeah. higher labor costs. And labor costs, they must be paid. Yes. And you can just do this when you are efficient. And, and if you have bring a value, and if you can achieve a higher price for your product, or let's say you get a good price, but you have lower production costs. Yeah. And that is uh, what is our aim to support this process. Now, as president of Gibbscam, um, you must know what's coming down, what new updates are coming. Do you have anything exciting you can maybe share that's coming down for Gibbscam? Um, yeah, we are working on a lot of things, let's say. Uh, we have now, uh, in the upcoming Gibbscam 2026, mm -hmm. some new features, um, but we made also one bigger replacement of a uh, three-axis engine, I would say, we, uh, we uh, bought from somebody else and we changed now the supplier. That was a big portion of work, okay. more work than we all, when as uh, more work as we thought and also our supplier thought. And we have some good other topics um, we added and we will also um, have in January a next version of Gibbscam with some, let's say, it's an intermediate version, it's not yes. a full new version with additional features which are coming. And so we are continuously working on this. For us, sustainability is a big point, not from Gibbscam perspective, also from Sandvik Group. And so with these steps, innovations we do now, 
we are talking about reducing programming times and reducing cycle times in production. So that is our focus, or one of our focus, one of the results we will deliver with the new version. Awesome, so we've got GibChem 2026 coming out and then another release up in January. Yes, an intermediate uh, version, let's say the next Gibscom 2027, we will have in September next year in 2026 for IMTS. Yes. Uh, but uh, now, yeah, we will work on this intermediate uh, version uh, for beginning of the year, and we have there, I think, two tr quite good uh, topics we will integrate, yeah. Well, that's very exciting, Thorsten. Thank you so much for updating us with everything that's becoming new and upcoming for Gibscam. Yeah, we all know a very exciting journey, technically and from business perspective, and we will make it.